was exciting to celebrate our seventh issue by having a launch party in such a significant location, yeah. like the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Being in the pagoda overlooking the bricks and the track was just a beautiful place to be. And of course, fitting way to celebrate an issue that focused on performance and sports. Indianapolis is known as a sports capital of the world. I think that that's something that we need to be really proud of as a city. They just felt right to highlight that in one of our issues and talk about how sports and arts and fashion can better intersect. I think that there's a lot of unexplored potential there for all the different organizations and businesses that are involved in those areas. I can see there being a lot of synergy when entities representing those different industries come together. Part of my thinking with the issue was maybe to challenge some of those bigger teams that don't necessarily need a fan base to do more of that. And what cool, awesome things could happen if, if those teams with the resources that they, they had and media draw, if, if they got engaged a little bit more. We wanted to explore that in a visual way to make people think uh, athletes, are engaged in the city, or their art collectors, or their fashion designers, and vice versa, where we brought in artists or photographers or makeup artists that had worked with athletes and in that industry or were fans of a particular sport. Drawing those parallels felt like the right thing to do.